Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will discuss principle of virtual work applied for beams. Today's problem is a simply supported beam AB of span 5 meters is loaded as shown in figure. Using the principle of virtual work, find the reactions at A and B. In this problem, given is a simply supported beam as shown in figure, total span of the beam is 5 meters and it is supported at A and B and a load of 5 kilo Newton is applied at point C distance from um, point A to C is 1 meter and from D to B the span is 3 meters and a uniformly distributed load of 2 kilo Newton per meter is applied as shown in figure. So in this problem we need to find reactions at A and B using principle of virtual work. Let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. To find reaction at B R B, let us give a virtual displacement of delta B at B. So the beam will assume this position A, C prime, D prime and B prime. So here we have three similar triangles A, C, C prime, A, D, D prime, A, B, B prime. So from A to B is 5 meters and displacement is delta B. From A to D is 2 meters and displacement is delta D. From A to C is 1 meter and displacement is delta C. So from these three similar triangles we can write delta B by 5 equal to delta D by 2 equal to delta C by 1. So from this equation we can write delta C equal to 1 by 5 into delta B delta D equal to 2 by 5 into delta B. Now let us write virtual work equation. So the equation is minus 5 into delta C minus 5 kilo Newton since work, uh, load is acting vertically downwards and displacement is given vertically upwards. So minus 5 into delta C minus 2 this 2 kilo Newton per meter into the total distance from D to B is 3 meters. So 2 into 3 into the average displacement between points D and B is delta D plus delta B by 2. So that is written here. So minus 2 into 3 into delta D plus delta B by 2 plus RB into delta B equal to 0. So RB is acting vertically upwards and delta B is also given in the upward direction. So plus plus rb into delta b equal to 0. So in this equation uh, let us substitute the values of delta c, delta d, delta b that we have seen in the previous slide and after simplifying we get reaction at b delta b reaction at b rb equal to 5.2 kilo newtons. Now to find reaction at a r a let us give a virtual displacement of delta a at a. So the beam will assume this position B, D prime, C prime and A prime. So here also we have three similar triangles B, D, D prime, B, C, C prime, B, A, A prime. So the distance from A to B is 5 meters and distance from C to B is 4 meters and from D to B is 3 meters. So the displacement at A is delta A, displacement at C is delta C, displacement at D is delta D and at B it is 0. So from these three similar triangles we can write delta A by 5 equal to delta C by 4 equal to delta D by 3. So from this equation we can write delta D equal to 3 by 5 into delta A, delta C equal to 4 by 5 into delta A. Now let us write virtual work equation. So the equation is plus RA into delta A. So RA is acting upwards and displacement is also given in the upward direction. So plus RA into delta A minus 5 into delta C. So 5 kilo Newton is acting downwards and delta C is in the upward direction. So minus 5 into delta C and for this UDL 2 kilo Newton per meter into the span 3 meters 2 into 3 into average displacement between D and B is delta D plus delta B by 2 equal to 0. So this is the virtual work equation. So in this equation let us substitute values for delta A, delta C and delta D since delta B equal to 0 that we have seen in the previous slide and simplifying we get reaction at A R A equal to 5.8 kilo newtons. That's all for today's video. If you like this content, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.